in this quick video. I'm going to show you how to use ChatGPT4 for free. Now, the first example here is the ghosttogether.com. Now, just register for an account and click on the login button. I already have an account, so I'm just going to log in. Now, once logged in, make sure to click on the robot button. And at the bottom here, you can choose a GPT model. Go ahead and type your prompt and click on the rocket button. Now, at this point, ChatGPT received your message and all you have to do is wait for the blue alert to appear here. When that happens, just go ahead and click on that and you'll see your ChatGPT answer in notifications. Just keep in mind, this is a public server so other users can answer your message as well. Another site where you can use ChatGPT4 for free is po.com once you're on the site on the left hand side you'll see all kinds of ai models sage gpt4 chat gpt so you can compare results from different ai models if you want to use chat gpt4 for free simply use gpt4 on the left hand side but remember guys po.com limits your gpt4 prompt to one per day there's another way of using gpt4 for free and that is the huggingface.co website. Now here, go to spaces and in this box, type GPT-4. Now, some of them might be really slow or might not work at all, but the one that I found that works is called GPT-4 All. Here, it's showing up as number two on search results. So I'm gonna go there. And then in the question box, just type your GPT-4 prompt and press on the teal generate button. Now, the last example here, and probably the best way to use chat GPT-4 on the line with almost free GPT-4 access. This is the nat.dev dashboard. It looks a lot like OpenAI's own user interface. They started out with completely free ChatGPT4 access, but with hundreds of people using it for free, somebody has to pay. So this is why they introduced $5 fee to get enough credits to get started. Now, this is four times less expensive than ChatGPT4+, but you also get about 10 other AI models. 